Hey everybody, it is Pixel, and today we're going to be making a really fun one-pan breakfast, or even, in my opinion, lunch sandwich. For that, we're going to need three or four eggs, two pieces of sandwich bread, bacon, tomatoes, Swiss cheese, ham, and a little bit of mayonnaise, in my opinion. This really shouldn't take that much to make, so let's get going. First off, you're going to want to pour your eggs into the bigger pan. Make sure they cover the whole thing. Then you're going to be putting in two pieces of sandwich bread. All right. You're going to give that a little bit of time to cook until you think it's able to be flipped over. Now it's not going to be too easy, but you're going to want to put up the edges and try to flip this over so that the top of the toast that isn't already starting to cook is on the bottom. And then we can fold our eggs in and start assembling our sandwich. When we've done that, our sandwich will look like that with two pieces, one and two. With that knowledge of where they are, you're going to want to start putting on your ham and your bacon. want to put on a piece or two of your cheese and since I love things kind of cheesy we'll do that now of course I'm gonna flip it so it's on the bottom <laughs> put that last piece of bacon on there last but not least I'm gonna put on my two pieces of tomato and your sandwich will look a lot like that and it just needs to finish cooking on both sides It's a really heavy, nice thing to flip over, though. There you go. Looks a lot like French toast when it's done, almost. Press that down a little. We'll be cutting that in half and breaking into it in a minute. All right, we've taken that off the stove and cut it into two pieces. And that is what the inside layer looks like. It's a beautiful, thick breakfast sandwich. We're going to let this cool off for maybe about five minutes, and then we can try it. All right, I took a little bite, see how it would go, and it's actually really good. I totally want to go finish this. This side got a little less of the ham because it shifted around, but that's okay. Still has some amazing egg and almost like a custard-like consistency to it. And I put a little drop of ketchup in the stuff, so. This is actually really faster than I thought to make breakfast. It's good. And, you know, if you have any thoughts, any comments, any way you would have done it differently, just let me know in the comments. I'm going to go finish my breakfast and see you in the next video. Later.